Hi there. Welcome to the release of MCJ ESO Surface. MCJ ESO Surface is a free plugin for Des Studio version 3. It only works on PCs. Maybe someday, there will be a version for Macs, you never know. Alas, July and soon, so let's get to it. We use Des Studios, Create, Menu. And we create a new MCJ ESO Surface. This box is called the domain. The ESO surface will only exist within that box. Let's create a metaball using the Meta Console script. There, that surface, that's the ESO surface. It represents the zone of influence of Metaball 0. If I scale Metaball 0 by 500%, the zone of influence becomes 5 times larger. Let's go in the Surfaces tab. We can change the color of the ESO surface. And we can change the ambient color. We can apply an image as the diffuse color. You can also apply an image to the reflection channel. This gives the ESO surface a bizarre mirror effect. Maybe in the next version, the mirror effect will be improved. Let's create another Meta ball using the Meta console script. Let's move the two meta balls apart. See what happened? The ESO surface now shows the combined influence of both meta balls. If we select the ESO surface and go in the parameters tab, we see this button here which lets us display the ESO surface as a wireframe. And there's that button which lets us hide the domain box. This slider here lets you increase the smoothness of the ESO surface. Increasing smoothness will decrease Des Studio's responsiveness. A setting of 1 means the domain is subdivided into 32 thousands cubes. A setting of 8 means the domain is subdivided into 16 million cubes. This setting should only be used just before rendering. Then it should be brought down to 2. Since this presentation began, 12 new meta shapes have been added. The plane. The cylinder. The torus. The tube, the stick, the dome, the disc, the sphere, the cube, the walls, the cup, and the new ball. The ESO service can now be rendered in software render mode. And it can be exported as an OBJ file. Well that's more time than we had, so bye bye and see you soon.